We're at the Kansas City Zoo in the Hellsburg Penguin Plaza, and behind me is our reef tank. Uh, we've got Dory in there. We have two Dories. She is a blue tang. And they get that name from the blue color of uh, their scales. They also have a black pattern on their body and a really pretty yellow on their fins and some freckles, some cute little freckles on their faces. Uh, we also have two different kinds of clownfish in here, so you can also find Nemo when you come to the zoo. We have another species of tang called a yellow tang. We have a watchman goby, 10 Bengai cardinal fish, and a bicolor dotty back in here. My name is Susan. I work on the Water's Edge Department at the Kansas City Zoo, and we work with everything from polar bears and river otters to jellyfish, penguins, and blue tangs. Clownfish are probably about an inch long. Uh, blue tangs can get about eight inches long, maybe a foot long if they're taken care of really well. They can also live for a really long time, about 20 years. Uh, our tangs are extremely silly fish. Um, they like to swim upside down, they swim all over the tank, they like to play in the jets where the water's coming in, a lot like the character Dory from the movie. So we feed them twice a day and blue tangs are omnivores, so they get a really wide variety of food. We give them uh, chopped up fish, we give them krill, we give them flakes, we give them pellets, a really special gel that has a lot of vitamins and nutrients in it that are good for the fish. Uh, we have to scrub that tank every single day. Uh, we dive it once a week. They're not really friends in the wild, but they don't really fight either. Um, they're not really going on adventures or anything like that, though. Right. I do believe that fish can communicate with each other. Uh, you can actually see them, they'll posture at each other uh, when they don't like things, or if they do like each other, they might rub against each other. So they will make faces, essentially. <laughs> We didn't name our fish in our exhibit. A lot of people call them Dory. We call them Dory and Nemo a lot of times, but there are five Nemos and two Dorys. And then we also have a penguin named Dory, a Gen 2 penguin. So if you look for a bird with an orange band and green beads, you can find Dory in our penguin exhibit. Fish can make good pets, but you have to make sure that you are researching the kind of fish you're getting and where you're getting it from so that you make sure you're getting it from a sustainable source. And you know, an animal like this one, blue tanks can get to be eight inches long, they can live for up to 20 years, the water can be expensive to mix and maintain. So it's something you really have to think about before you invest in. Uh, but if you don't think that that's for you, you can always come out to the Kansas City Zoo and find Dory here. 